I once read this article that claimed children who have very strict mothers tend to have like like to have unconfidence in them. Now we're talking about strict now. So what is strict? Well, strict is really just like when you do something wrong, you're like, okay, don't do that, and next time you should do this, and like you really shouldn't do that, and sometimes that you get they, they get a little mad, but that's really it, right? Strict isn't like like okay, like right and perf like perfect cursive and never use any eraser. Or, like, always be number one in everything you do. Or, like, always keep your back straight. That is too strict. But that technically isn't strict. That is torture. Okay, I, I, can't, I, I, can, uh, I can tell you that. That is not strict. That is torture. So, this version of strict almost never appears. In fact, never appears between mother and children or parents and children. Because they love you. You think they're strict, and they're like, "Oh, they don't care about me." It's not like that. They they just want they, they just like want you to be a better person. I mean, what do you expect them to like applaud and be like, "Okay, do it again." Ah, uh, it's okay. Like, what, what, like seriously, you think they're gonna do that? That just doesn't make any sense. So, it's like. So strict isn't really like the strict that like I don't know like is is in movies or like is in your like is in, or like is in the back of your mind. Strict is not like that. Besides, it's just like in school. I mean, like of course our teachers get like 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 kind of oh, we just go back a little bit. Let's just say like I don't know like you accidentally like do something wrong. I'm not sure. Like you just do something wrong, and then she just like no 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 you shouldn't do that, and then she gives a little punishment. I don't know. Like, whatever your school does for little punishments. <laughs> so, so, like, she does that. But really, if you think about it, is it any worse than that? Does, does she, like, send you to, to the principal? Sometimes she does, but, like, think about it. Like, again, what do you expect from her? Do you expect you, like, do you expect her to, like, give you a lollipop and a homework pass and all that? Like, like, do you really expect that? Normal children don't get that. People, oh, but children who do naughty things don't get that either. I think you know that. But anyways, so, like, really, as long as you don't do anything serious, they just give, they give you a little punishment, but is it any worse? I want to say that. I don't mean like you shouldn't care. Like, like you should care and listen to them. But is it any worse than just getting a little punishment and just like, like if you don't do it next time, will it? Will like really anything happen if you just don't do it? Because it was sort of like your fault, right? It was your fault that you got punished, punished, right? It was, it was. They won't punish you for no reason. But you, you did something wrong, and then like you probably knew you shouldn't do it. So. She gave you a little punishment, that's it. She didn't even throw you into jail or something. <laughs> that would be crazy. So, really, how can you be this, like, how can you expect the teacher not to, like, do anything? And also, this word strict and confidence, the fact that you might be unconfident, doesn't even, like, make sense. Like, those two words are completely unrelated. Because let's just say... I go back to math, my favorite subject. Math, well, just say you're like, really, like, like you're really, really good at math. And like, like you have a very strict parents and then your parents are like really strict on you. Well, like, like what is, like, like how is your confidence gonna, like how is your confidence in math and your talent in math gonna go away? Like strictness of your parents isn't gonna make your math talent go away. Because even if like, like even if like your parents like like you miss a really like a like you miss an easy problem and then that you like that or like is like like it's it's not like beyond your power sort of thing you just like it's like a problem it's like it's like I don't know like it's like you miss an easy like you like you miss a math problem that you're supposed to know how to do and then your parents get a little mad well. Of course, it's an easy math problem, right? You're, you're supposed to know how to do it. In fact, this happens with me, and then sometimes I even curse myself. I'm like, okay, I am stupid. <laughs> I, like, how did I miss that? That is, like, the easiest thing in the world. So it's like that. I'm like, how did I miss that? So so it's like that. Just, like, a lot of times, like, oh, that is easy. <laughs> Like, like, you're not gonna be like, okay, like, like, you're doing pre-algebra and then some, like, 
and then like your parents force you to do calculus they're not gonna do that and besides if you miss an easy problem and then they get like like really mad and then you miss a lot more easy problems and then they get more mad like your confidence in math your talent in math isn't gonna go away just because like you miss like like a few problems and your parents get mad at you they that doesn't mean they don't love you that 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 doesn't mean you're horrible at math that doesn't mean you will be horrible at math and that doesn't mean your confidence in math will shatter and if, if you're not good at math and and well you work hard at math well we're, we're still confident in math right you let you love math right you're like because you work hard on it, your confidence isn't going to magically blow away into the wind or disappear somehow just because you have, like, strict parents. So, like, it just, for me, it's just, like, weird that, like, they say that, like, confidence and, like, strictness, and they're not even talking about the right strictness they're saying like they're saying life is a whole movie and then strict is the strict that I've talked about at the beginning of the video. So when I saw this article, it just made me it just made my mind blow up. I was like, what in the world are you talking about? Strict and unconfident have not has nothing to do in common. Uh, I hope my argument was good enough and if you don't think it was good enough and you think there's some other reason like like confidence might shatter because of strict because in some way i don't know what that some way is i'm not even sure if there is a some way for me it just doesn't make any sense if for you if does if it does make sense please just tell me if there is a way that your confidence can shatter by like strict parents